We got some more houses up here. It's the public footpath. It's the light really doesn't want to guide us anymore. What the heck? I don't know. Oh, I hear something in there. What the heck was that? Let's go find out. What is in there? Let's go. Can we even get in here? Oh, there, there. We have some light. We have some light. I just saw it. Okay. I think we're going the right path here. Oh, this is a substation. Yes, this is where he was hanging out, wasn't he? Oh. We have a radio. Pressure in my eyes again. I can't move my legs, can't feel my face. When I collapsed, the light was waiting for me there. Caught me, lowered me here. Now it's pooling around my feet, watching me. The printers are spewing out page after page of zeros. It's frightening too. Huh. It'll be okay. It'll be fine. I'll look after you. It's alone. It's scared. Oh, it's traveled so far. It's okay. I can help you. Oh my God, Kate. Now. Ten seconds to signal fusion. What? What the hell is she doing? Two. What the hell, Kate? Why? Why would you do such a thing? Are you serious? Oh my God, Kate. Okay, we gotta find a way in here. I keep hearing weird freaking noises everywhere, man. It's freaking me out. Why is this light on? Alright, how the hell do we get in here? Or can we even? Doesn't look like we can. He was talking, what? He talked about a bunker? Was it, did he say near the substation? I can't remember exactly what he said. Okay, I think we're done here, though. Let's continue down here and see. Oh. Oh, yeah, see, we're going the right way. What do you want me to say? You knew what you were getting into. Really? Well, I'm sorry we don't measure up to your exacting standards, Dr. Collins. Maybe you just need to give us ordinary humans a break. What? Ordinary humans like oh. Lizzie Graves? Did you really think that I wouldn't find out? Frank told me. Or did you forget there's one person in this shithole who actually talks to me? Kate. It was just a dream. Don't bother, Stephen. Oh. oh, for Christ's sake. Kate, slow down. You were engaged to her, Stephen. You nearly married oh, her. Oh, come on, it was just a drink. Then why the hell did you lie to me about because it? Because I knew you'd be mad and then it would a end row. up in a row. You wanted to focus on the event tonight. Oh, so you were actually doing me a favor. Wow, I guess I just forgot to say thank you. Do not treat me like I'm an idiot. You're overreacting. I know, I know you're stressed. Just don't. <laughs> you keep away from me tonight. I'm not going to let you ruin this for me. 
Kate. Kate, come on, this is crazy. No, Steven. Way to go. Totally screwed that up, didn't you? Dumbass. Huh. Okay. So we're gonna keep going this way, I guess? I have no idea. I mean, it, want, it, it keeps... It's like it wants us to keep going this way, so... Let's do it. And we just got a checkpoint. Sweet! Oh! Oh, I hear a phone! Yes! Answer it! It's all over the valley. Don't you get that? This isn't some abstract thing. Whatever came down into the tower has got out. They've quarantined the whole valley. It's right here in the observatory. It's out in the world. It's adapting and spreading. Do you understand? No, we can't turn it away. It's come too far. Okay, people are disappearing. Shut it down now. No! If you won't help me, I'll do it on my own. I'm gonna route all the power back through Tower 6. Wait, wait, wait. Uh oh. It's trying to break through again. Damn it, Kate! Freaking. Oh! This is maddening. I'm so very mad right now. Can you tell how mad I am? I do kind of hear something. I don't think there's anything back here. Maybe go through that gate. Was there any exits over here? No. Eh? Hmm. There's nothing back here. Alright, let's just try going this way. We don't have a light to guide us, unfortunately, but... Looks like this is the way to go, though. Well, I think at the time they had that argument that Steven wasn't actually... Steven and Lizzie weren't actually, you know, sleeping together. I'm trying to look for it and listen at the same time. I don't think we've been up this way, have we? Oh. Jesus, man, what do you done to your face? It's nothing. You collecting feed? Looks like the supplies haven't been coming in. Huh. Again? The phones are all strange. I can't pinpoint the logic of transmission. You what? What are you doing with that paint? Means the EMC are actually moving at the proper speed. Listen, Frank. Have you uh, heard anything on the radio about a flu outbreak? Doesn't seem much like flu to me. They're shutting down access to the valley to try and isolate it. No, something about the phones. I can't put my finger on it quite yet. What are you talking about? Hey, I'm still talking to you. Where are you going? Oh, oh, telephone. Telephone. Okay, we're going the right way. Woo! We're on the correct path, hopefully. Okay, there's a telephone ringing in here. Let's go find out who's calling. Is it Kate or is it Steven? Hello? Hello, is there anyone there? Can anyone hear me? Clive? Clive, it's Steven Appleton. Are you there? Can you hear me? Over. Come on, Clive, where are you? Steven, come in Tower 6. Kate, are you there? Kate! Anyone? Hello? Can anyone hear me? This is Dr. Stephen Appleton broadcasting from within the quarantine zone. Can anybody Whoa. hear me? Oh, oh God, no. No. Fucking hell, no! What the hell? Okay, so was he trying to call off the airstrike? It almost sounded like he's trying to get a hold of Clive, who was called, who had called in the airstrike. It sounded like maybe he was trying to uh, call it off. I don't know. 
Maybe he found the solution, but too late. Oh, radio time. This is Catherine Collins, recording for posterity. What? It's all over. I don't know how long I've got. Whatever he did, whatever the planes were carrying, it's burning my lungs. Probably some kind of nerve agent. I suspect it's only exposure to the pattern that has kept me alive this long. I'm making my way to Tower 6. I'm going to fuse the signals from the optical array. I just... I just Damn, she's connected. trying to save it. Son of a bitch, Kate. Well, that's just great. We lost the light again. Freaking hell. Alright, let's go this way. There's gotta be more... more clues here. So it was the nerve agent they basically bombed the valley with. And, uh, Kate's the only one that's still alive right now. And she's still trying to save the, uh, whatever the hell it is. There's definitely something in here. I think. You're a daft old bird walking all the way out here for it. You know Charlie would have dropped it off. What? And have that stinking great lorry of his poisoning my birds? He shouldn't be driving it on these lanes. It's a hazard. I think he was hoping he could have a word with you about Frank. There's nothing to say. Oh, listen, Wendy, they might all be scared of you, but that's not going to work with me. You're 68 years old. Grow up. Talk to Frank. How huh. dare you speak to me like that? Give me my bird feeder right now. Promise me you'll drop by and see your brother. Megan Holloway, give Not a me chance. Promise me. It's for your own good, and you know it. You are a shamelessly huh. manipulative and difficult woman. It's no wonder Charlie adores you so much. <laughs> No wonder I do what? No wonder you never finish what you start. I thought I told you to check the incoming stock orders. Wendy, one bird feeder for you. I'll tell Frank <laughs> you stop by. Oh. Charlie, stop mooning around and stick the kettle on. Make yourself yeah, stick useful. Stick the kettle, kettle on. Charlie, stick the kettle on. All right. Well, we're still making progress here, so that's good. Steven's got quite the story to tell, apparently. Yeah, we can't get by. Let's go see if there's anything in the warehouse. Whoa. Oh, yeah, I guess there is. This might be the end. Nope. Appleton! What are you doing here? You thieving bastard! I knew it was you! Listen, take everything you need, but then you have to leave. You don't understand. You can't be near me. Painting these stupid little pictures. Stealing food. You always were a little prick. Please, every second we're in proximity makes it worse. I'm a primary conduit. You're a fucking disgrace. Come here! Don't what touch me! Get off! What the going on? Come in here! Lord. Jesus, Get over Sam! Us. Thinking you're so much better Sam, than the rest of us. No physical you contact. You stupid fucking missus. Oh. <laughs> oh snap. He he killed Sam. 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 <laughs> Meg, please. Don't, don't come near me. Meg. <laughs> Charlie. Meg. Meg, wait. Don't, don't touch me. Meg, please, you have to understand. It was an accident. Get off her. Let go. Let's just go. Charlie. You have to understand, it was an accident. Let's just leave him. Leave him! What have you done, Appleton, you bastard? Come on, Charlie, let's Damn. just Charlie, here. please! Steven, how can you kill Sam? You killed Sam, damn it! Son of a... Bitch. Poor Sam. Alright, now where the hell do we go? Oh, saving. I don't know where the light is. Please, light guide the way. I think we gotta go up here. Let's go up this way. Steven killed Sam, yeah. Seems like it. 
poor bastard. Oh. Oh, I definitely hear something here. Nice. Oh, we got the lights on. Yeah. What's happening in here? Speaking, Howard, it's Clive. Clive Smith. I need you to listen to me and not ask questions or interrupt. Can you do that? Yeah, I can. But why are you calling? The Emergency Measures Committee is imposing a quarantine around the valley. We've got an influenza outbreak in the village. We're suspending rail services, and we're also going to be shutting down the roads for a bit. Uh, you're going to be dealing with some anxious people, Howard, so you need to explain it's all under control, and we'll be back to normal in a few days. All right? Open up the emergency store. There's posters and boards, along with a bunch of stuff that hasn't been used since the war. Grab anything you think might be useful. I need you to close up any unoccupied buildings, put posters up, that sort of thing. Make sure everything is all squared away in shipshape. You are a military man, I'm sure you understand that. Everyone doing their bit, following their orders. All right? All right? <laughs> I think. Good man. I knew we could count on you. Oh. Oh, hey, the lights back! The lights, please. I need to see where you're going. Okay, he's going up the road. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. We got this. Yeah, that was the thing. That was it. Traveling through the phone lines. Infecting. It's like a freaking extended episode of the X Files. <laughs> Okay, so it wants us to go down to the train tracks here. Alright. Oh. Hold on, let's hit this radio first. Repeating over and over to myself in the dark. Eating cold food from a can with my fingers. My name is Catherine Collins. I am Catherine Collins. As if I can force the world to acknowledge my existence. Time has ceased to exist in any real terms. I'm reduced what? to marking out the days on the walls. Like a cave woman. What the hell? Is she still alive? My god. So she survived the, uh, the gas. Damn. Alright, little lights. I'm glad to see you're back with us. Woohoo! It's like I'm hearing birds, but supposedly all the birds are dead. Alright, we're at the train station. Nice. Ah, you stop in there, I see. Just don't get stuck there, please. Oh, right, here we go. This might be the end part. Yep, definitely is. Darling Stephen, I don't know if you'll ever listen to this. Uh, maybe Aww. you've decided to stay with Kate, and I, I can't blame you for that. But I can't wait for you either. I the baby? Think about the baby. And, well, <laughs> I oh, should have left a long time ago. I've run out of excuses for not leaving now. But I do love you, Stephen. And I hope you find peace one way or another. Ah, oh. oh, shit. Oh, come on. Oh, not Lizzie. No, not Lizzie and the baby. Son of a. Oh, man. Lizzie, you should have left like way sooner. Freaking hell. Damn, Lizzie. Sorry. Why do you want me in here? Okay, come in, lights. Aww. Aw, look, it's daytime again. Now what, light? Damn, man. 
Seriously, I have freaking goosebumps. Jesus. Where are we going now? Down here? Usually it would uh, be all dark and, and have like a lighted path for me, but you know, maybe not this time. Whatever. There goes the tunnel. There's no trains. I'll put up a sign. The tunnel, Howard. Is it closed? I think so. I don't like it. It's not right at all. Stop whining. It doesn't help anyone. Did you know you're bleeding? Oh, it's this headache. It's just killing me. I haven't had a nosebleed like this since I was a kid. But you've not been to the village? No, I've been here the last couple of days, or at home. I've only spoken to Clive at the EMC on the phone. Well, tried to anyway, but with all the cross lines... It... But no direct contact with any other people? No, hmm. no one. What are you talking about? What's going on? It's the pattern. It's adapted again. It doesn't need direct contact to transfer. It's using the phones. What do you mean, direct contact? Steve-on! Yeah, Steve-on! What do you mean? All right, we're going this way. Wow. There's a lot of stuff going. Wow, it's using the power lines, maybe. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going here. We're going here. We're going here. I know. There's a lot of stuff happening here. Definitely something happening here. Okay, you want me to investigate? Okay, I'm on it. We were already here once, but there must be something else. Can we get inside? No? Oh, damn. I hear, I hear stuff. I hear things happening. I don't know what's happening! Around this way? Maybe right here? Oh, it's open! Okay, this wasn't open before. Oh, this where was this was where uh, Steven was probably hiding. Interesting. Yes, 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 I'm going. I can't travel as fast as you right now, little light. What? Don't go in bunker till you watch cutscenes on the little path. What little path are you talking about? All right, somebody wants me to follow the lines. 